what is up guys and welcome back to another video now i apologize that i haven't been uploading much over the last week but i actually took a vacation a little holiday with my girlfriend and my brother and we actually went to mexico so if you guys are interested in seeing some of my other life off the crypto side of things i do have a vlog channel that you guys can see down below i did just release one of the videos from mexico where we did some diving into cenotes and some atvs so go and check that out if that interests you but today we're going to be talking about some of my recent portfolio updates on all these staking platforms now if you've been following my channel you've seen that i've come out with quite a few staking platforms and i've tried quite a few as well so they have been incredibly interesting to me because of the outstanding apys like 88,000 percent half a million percent so in today's video we're going to be going over all of my staking platforms and those include of course wonderland time the clima dow metaverse pro and hector dow now some of them have made me money and some of them have lost me money so we're going to be going over all of this in the video today if that interests you, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. I will be doing an update on my strong block just as soon as I finish this one. So make sure you guys look for that in the near future. Now, the last step I have for you guys is I do have a private Discord chat where we talk about all of these platforms even before I make YouTube videos. There is a link down below. There's about a thousand of us in the group and it is a great little community to be involved in. If that interests you, link is down below. But without further ado, enough chatting from me. Let's start looking into my portfolio and see how these staking platforms have managed themselves over the last couple weeks. So as we can see on my channel down below here, one of the first ones I had made about just over a month ago was how to stake Wonderland time. So of course, I want to jump into that and I have created a little Excel sheet sheet for all of us to follow along make it easy for it to be digested here but let's take a look at wonderland time so looking at my portfolio i wasn't very impressed to see that it had almost dropped 50 percent since when i had purchased in now if we're looking at a three month chart here we can see it was going up and down sort of in this channel sort of trading sideways for uh, about a month or so before it decided to take a dip now the entire market has been taking a dip before the end of q4 now i think there are bigger plays here at stake where people are messing with the different taxes that they're going to have to pay so much and so forth i'm not going to get into that in this video but we can see here in the last month uh, in the last week we have seen maybe a little bit of a reversal and i'm hoping no pun intended we can turn back the time and get it back up closer to that seven to eight thousand dollar mark so let's get inside my dashboard here I'm gonna to have to switch to the Avalanche network and we can check out how much is currently in my account all right so inside the Wonderland dashboard as we can see here the stake balance 0.337 MIMO now if you guys don't know how to stake I do have other videos that explain how to do this I go over step by step and try to answer as many questions as possible so please go and check those out if you haven't already now we have dropped slightly to 72,000 percent APY but this isn't a huge deal now I do want to mention on the left side of the page here they have integrated a calculator on their website on their dashboard so if you guys would like to try to play around with the numbers numbers, the APYs, and what you think is possible with this dashboard you can see down below here. The return on how many days, at what MIMO you have currently staked, the APY, and the purchasing price. Now again, as we've seen, this has been very volatile. It has dropped quite substantially in the last month, but this could mean a great entry point to start purchasing or staking for yourself. So let's get into how this has actually worked out for me. So the very first one, as we can see here, I had invested in Time Wonderland close to November 3rd. Now I invested about $1,000 was the cash equivalent, which got me 0.12 time. Now currently, as we can see inside the dashboard, I have 0.337 time. And with a current price of 37.23, as we have found on the coin market cap here, just a little different as I'm filming here, the cash equivalent is about $1,254. So with 48 days invested, just over a month and a half, we currently have an ROI of 26% on my cash. Now there's a little difference here because of the volatility of the coin. 
the ROI on my actual coin is closer to 180%, but in terms of cash, I am only up 26%. Now I'm not complaining, of course, 26% in 48 days is still an outstanding way to make money passively. And this is why I wanna show you guys how I've done this. Now, of course, calculating the ROI, I have done it as such the net return divided over your initial times 100. So again, this would have been my cash equivalent minus what I invested divided over what I invested, which had given me 26%. So again, I am happy with this investment. Currently, it could have been doing a ton better if we were at that seven, 8,000 percent. But this is more of a long term hold for me. I'm trying to get closer to those incredible APYs. And this is another reason why I'm doing a handful of different platforms and different tokens is because let's say the loss on one or two of them will be completely made up if any of them have hit that claimed APY on all their dashboards. All right, so now let's get into the second one, Climate Dow. And now this one again is doing not so good. It's actually doing way worse than I thought it would be doing. Again, it was on the Polygon network and backed by Climate Credits. So something I still feel is going to be huge in the future. We are seeing a 7% jump today, but over the last three months, as we can see here, it has steadily decreased. So jumping into the dashboard here, we'll pull up how much I am currently staking. So currently on the Polygon network, we are at 0.4436 staked Clima. So with the current price, let's see how this is, has worked out for us. All right, so currently going over this, I had started it on November 5th, invested 0.2, which was about $400 at the time. Currently I have 0.44 as we saw inside the dashboard with a current price of 280. Now this again is a tough pill to swallow because we had purchased it and when it was closer to $2,000, which is a tough, tough one to swallow. So working out how it has gone through, the cash equivalent is now only worth $124, which means a negative 70% return on my investment. So the ROI of the coin, although it has done still quite well up 120%, doesn't really matter if the price when you purchase in drops as significantly as it's done. All right, so the next one would be my Metaverse Pro staking. Now I'm gonna connect to this wallet and it is on the BSC. All right, so inside my dashboard here, we can see that the staked balance is 1.68 meta. And you can already see here the staked value is around $400 as we can see there and my current earnings per day. Now they do, they have all tried to start integrating some of these calculators, which has been a huge help for people to understand uh, and extrapolate their income here. So let's pull this down and check out where we are at with Meta. But as we can see on CoinMarketCap, we're currently at $243 and sort of all over the place over the last month, as we can see here. So let's work out sort of what we have made from staking it on this sheet here. November 27th, we decided to stake one token. This cash equivalent was around $350 and we're currently at just under 1.7 meta with a current price of $243. That gives us a cash equivalent of about $410. So in terms of my cash, I am up 17% in 25 days. So under less than a month, we're up 17% on the cash and the ROI on the coin is closer to 70%. Now, last but not least was my latest staking on the Hector Dow. As we can see here, it's currently sitting at $65, up 17% on 24 hours, which is good to see. But again, on the month, it had taken a substantial hit with that market dip. Hopefully we'll see that turn around. But again, it was purchased at a much higher price around that $200. So we will see where we go from there. So on the Phantom Network, we are inside the dashboard here and we can see that we have 1.59, almost 1.6 staked Hector with the price of the $65. Let's pull down and see where we are at currently today. So December 2nd was when I invested one token. The cash equivalent was about $220 as I had mentioned. Currently we have 1.6 at a price of $63. Gives us a cash equivalent of about $100. So a ROI of negative 50% in 19 days, but a 60% increase in the coin. 
So again, this wasn't a month or two play. This will be closer to a six month play for me. So we will hopefully see all of these shoot back up in terms of Q1 of 2022. Now, again, I'm not a financial advisor. None of this is financial advice. I'm just guessing here. I have my own strategy and I stick to it and I encourage you guys to do the same. So as a whole, I have brought this down here. We can see that through all four of these staking platforms, I invested just under $2,000 and currently the cash equivalent is just under that $2,000 again. So I haven't lost much money, negative 0.04%, so not even 1% of the portfolio yet. But again, it has been approximately just under two months. So I'm really going to wait to see what's happening in Q1 of 2022. And hopefully these will start making some decent profits. Now, as I mentioned before, I will be doing a strong block update as well as soon as I finish editing this video. So make sure to look out for that one. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, sort of this update on the portfolio. The markets have been everywhere this last December. As I mentioned before, there might be some larger plays going on, some shady stuff that people aren't yet noticing. But again, make sure you find your own strategy and stick to it. If you guys like the video, please like it, subscribe to the channel. And until next time, guys, take care.